It's time for another episode of The Profundities of Cooking with Tasty and our lovely assistant, Mario. Yeah, now that's right, okay, that's what we meant to do. Hello everyone, welcome to my food cooking show. We have a great guest here today. It's my uh, lovely uh, pleasure to welcome Hero of the Mushroom Kingdom, Mario, to the uh, audience. Mario, show off the good stuff. Show them what they like. Yeah, they like it, don't they? How do you stay so thin? My goodness. Our uh, Mario's here to help me cook today. And I'd like to show you some new recipes. Well, she got me a new cookbook, and it's very lovely. What do we have here today? Oh. Oh, you'd like me to make me a cake. Wouldn't that be nice? Okay. Now, what kind of cake would you like me to make? Ooh. I'll cook it with cake and lemon. Let's see what that comes up with. It'll be fabulous. The good thing about cooking is you never know what you're gonna get. Well, let's see what we got here. Ooh. And here's a real surprise for you. Not a cake at all. Turned into lemon candy. Isn't that nice? That's much better restorative power for the flower points there. We got a little bit of time left. How much more would you like me to cook? I know you're still hungry there, baby. You can't cook with lemon candy. More cake, huh? Sure. Let's do it. Ooh, honey cake. What'll that turn up with? I'll cook with this. That's right, baby. I'll be right back. Everything can be done in a few seconds when standing by the cooktop and singing. You can read it in my cookbook here. Ooh, the honey candy. That's lovely. Very high flower point, I think. I'm old and I don't do adventures, so I don't need my flower points. You can have this one. Uh, what? An another cake? Oh, okay. Okay, Mario, make another cake. Ooh, now that could be interesting. A, a nice hot cake. You know, I once traveled to Kuala Lumpur, and we had very, uh... The green thing with the blue egg. Um, oh, I actually don't remember. I'll have to check that one in a bit. I'll check the wiki. <laughs> I just pulled them off of Spider's resource. Ooh. <laughs> so this, uh, this restores 20 flower points, but it hurts you for one. Uh, you gotta, you gotta take the good with the bad. That's a straight downgrade from the thing I just made. That's weird. Are uh, you still hungry, Mario? I know you are. What do we got there? Yeah, a lot of cinnamon. It must be like a, uh, it must be like a fireball. Okay, uh, are we just doing cakes today? All right, sure, fine, whatever. Oh, the vault room. Well, we've got something that's very shocking, surely. Ho oh, oh. Just give me one moment. We don't pre prepare anything on this show, baby. There's no here's one I prepared earlier for me. What do we got here? Ooh, the Electro Pop. Um, okay, lots of... You're gonna have all the flower points you need. Okay, can I cook something savory, maybe? Like an egg or something? Ooh, a mushroom. That would be lovely. I could make some fried shroom with that. I could go ahead and, of course, you had one more fucking cake mix. Sure, fine. I'll mix your mushroom and your cake mix together. See if I give a damn. Oh, I'm gonna have to open up another bottle of wine to get through this show. You got a book that you're promoting or something today? Oh, this did work out. Let's see what it is. Ooh. My goodness, the shroom cake. A little bit more of a balanced meal there. Well, alright, we, um... We've been cooking for a little while now. I think it's about time for us to take a commercial break. So, please, stay with us. The profundities of cooking will be right back after these commercial messages. Because this ain't public television. I got bills to pay. And Bill's the name of my sugar baby. And I need sugar, baby. Mario, get over here. Bring that Italian sausage. And by Italian sausage, I mean your dick. Do you have trouble falling asleep at night? I could fall asleep if you didn't have those lights on! Try Sleepy Sheep, the drug three alternative to help you get to sleep. Uh, most of the time. Another satisfied customer. He'll wake up the next morning feeling refreshed and... Uh, um... 
Hmm. Uh, no, he's, he's not gonna wake up. Sleepy sheep, not to be taken internally. Hey y'all, I'm Rolf from Rolf's Bad Shop. People come up to me and say, Hey Rolf, what exactly are you? Are you some kind of dog? A groundhog? Some sort of space chicken? Come on down to Rolf's Bad Shop. We got good badges. We got bad badges. We got badges that you will never, ever, ever use. So come on over to Rolf's Bad Shop, across the street from the post office. Mention this ad and get 0% off. Please, please buy my badges. I only have one customer and I'm pretty sure he's an illegal immigrant. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oof. Uh. Woo -hoo. Let's -a go. Mamma mia. Boing. Call me more lovely on the Star Psychic Hotline. I need to know am I really the father of my wife's child? Is he ugly? No, not at all. Then no. Next caller, please. No, lovely. I was on hold for like two hours waiting for this. So I need to know, what does the future hold for me? A very big phone bill. Thanks for calling. Oh, my lovely. I was wondering if you just knew how much time I had left in this world. Not much. Next caller, please. Ah, uh, my lovely. Uh, I feel like my brother doesn't respect me. Steal his girlfriend. That works for me. Ah, uh, that's kind of up in the air right oh, I get it. You're impotent. I am not impotent anymore. I mean, oh! Call me now. I'll tell you the future in junk. Two ninety-five a minute? Screw that. You may be wondering, hey, what have you been doing to keep yourself occupied during the, uh, during the outbreak? Uh, that was just supposed to be an opening. No, paternity, I was so happy when I came up with that. Because when I looked up a, um, a video of Miss Cleo, which you guys are very happy I decided not to do a Jamaican accent for that. I couldn't, I was like, no, this is ridiculous. Um, the first question she asked in the video I found was someone asking about the paternity of her child. And I'm like, holy crap. I'm gonna buy Zap Tap for a reason that will become evident later. Four, wow, damn. Yeah. So, yeah, that was just supposed to be the opening, and then I was like, oh, then I can have a commercial. And then I came up with four of them, and I'm like, all right. Oh, I was, I thought you'd ask that, North. That's, um, that's the one you pop, uh, I don't remember the name of it, but you hit a guy with it, and they knock them into the one behind them. Um, so it's like the spin, the spin punch. That is one I don't believe I've ever used. Oh, and I looked it up while the commercials were running. That's the, the thing that was on the sidebar there was the strange cake. You get it by combining a strange leaf and a, um, and a cake mix. 